Welcome back to Happy Dinner. Today we're making my favorite Turkish carrot salad. For the ingredients and prep today, we'll need one kilo of carrots, some parsley, one head of garlic, a shallot, and an onion to taste. We have some olive oil and two cups of Greek yogurt. And for the olive oil, make sure to use a really good virgin olive oil. I have mine from a little farm in Puglia. For the carrots, we're going to have to knead a grater and then we can get to chopping. Honestly, the perfect dish to take over to a barbecue or when going over to a friend's house. It's seriously always the biggest crowd pleaser and I never have any leftovers to take home with me. And make sure that everyone eats some so nobody smells the beautiful garlic breath that this gives you. But did you guys know that garlic is such a powerful spice it is, as it is widely recognized for its ability to fight bacteria, viruses, and even fungi? Chop the garlic very small and also the onions very small so it will be perfect for in the dish. This is actually a dish that I learned from my best friend's mom and I'm so grateful for her teaching it to me as it is so quick and simple and easy to make and bring along. It is Important to serve the dish cold as the flavors are much, much better then. The parsley adds a nice fresh touch and we're using a little during the cooking and the rest as garnish. So chop it as you wish and we can then set it aside for later. Now we're getting into the part of the hard labor, but trust me, it's really worth it. We need to clean and grate the one kilo of carrots we have. And if you don't have time to grate everything, you can also just blitz it up into small bits in the blender. Trust me, you won't taste the difference. Once the carrots are fully grated, we can now start with the cooking process. We're going to heat up our pan and then we're going to put some oil in it. And then we're gonna saute our onions and garlic and our shallot in this. You can put a little bit more oil than you think because we have quite a lot of carrots in there. After about two to three minutes, once your garlic, onions, and shallots are nice and glassy and very fragrant, we can start adding the carrots in there. Carrots are amazingly healthy for you and are full of fiber, beta carotene, and vitamin K. Your body will definitely thank you for this nutrient-rich dish. And so when the carrots have been tossing and turning in the pan for around six minutes, add a half cup of water to help soften them up and then just keep them cooking for around another six minutes and until they're nice and soft and have this deep orange color. After it's steamed for a little bit, we're gonna go ahead and add some salt and pepper. I think you really have to do this a little bit on feeling, taste it, go along with it, and yeah, just make it your own. Give it a good stir, and then we can start adding half of our parsley. Make sure to keep the rest for a garnish as it gives it a beautiful green color. As you can see, this is kind of the desired color and texture that we're looking for. And now we're ready to add the yogurt. So here we're adding in the two cups of yogurt. We're gonna give it a, a good stir. We're not gonna keep it on the heat that much longer and then we can just set it aside to let it cool off naturally. Once it's at room temperature, we can set it in the fridge. Again, this dish is best served cold, so before you bring it anywhere or eat it, I mean, I would just say keep it in the fridge for an hour to two hours and then you're ready to plate up and go. Our carrot salad now has been sitting in the fridge for about two to three hours. We're ready to go to a dinner party and we're serving it up in a plate and we're gonna garnish it with the rest of our parsley, and then we're ready to go. Enjoy, guys. And thank you guys for watching another episode of Happy Dinner. Let us know in the comments what you wanna see next.